a very good afternoon Dutch bike blogger here again and of mooi land Put some juice in the camera again, aka uploaded my battery. Not directly driving home, making a drive around here where will I go I don't know turn on tree here and hopefully the people on the road will see me or not Let's go this way, to the right. Two people with a dog walking loose. Always, always be aware what the dog is going to do. You don't want to run over a dog. When it's not necessary, you will not do. It's never necessary, by the way, to run over a dog. But I'm never gonna break and fall. I can tell you. I'm not sure if this is a bike lane or a pedestrian lane, but it looks wide enough to cycle on. Some goats here. Not even sure where that's going. Well, that looks more like a walk lane than a bike lane. Okay. Really not sure. I think it's a walkway. Would be a bike lane. There wouldn't be not much that much potholes in there. Jesus, what a bad quality. Some horses, very nice horses, I have to say. Let me have a look. Hi there. Let's not bother them. Why should we? Well, according to the clouds, it could be a little rainy. Weather forecast said it wasn't. I do have my doubts. But I got my waterproof kit with me, so... I, on the other hand, am not waterproof, but... But 
you see where I'm ending up follow the road well, I could go in the woods but don't do that again well driving here to the east of Leeuwenborg it is on a small small lane still 20 21 degrees serious gonna doubt if it's 21 feels like 19 or lower Something about kids on the stones, not sure what. Not graves, they're informal things. Really don't know. Have a look at Google Maps to see what it is. More rights about children and whatnot. Kinderen hebben recht op vrede. Okay. Children have the right of peace and parents and whatnot. Well, all about children's rights. Nice to read. Oh. That was a big hole all across the lane, the bike lane. Or is it a bike lane? Well, at least it's flat enough to drive on. This is definitely not a bike lane that can be used to drive a bike. Had to wait for the jogger to pass the smaller well area and then could go by. Probably never heard I was there. At least I didn't ring my bell and then it's quite easy to miss it. Let's go into this wooded area. And now I'm driving towards the city again. And as you can see, it's really, 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 really not busy. No one here. Only me. Nice. It's a quite small wooded area. This is not good for my tires, I can assure you. Nice. 90 degree bend when you don't stop you end up in the water which you would not and could not and should not do water is actually quite high quite surprised A 
that's a more of a tarmac -y road where I'm driving on. No split on there, no gravel. Well, look like I'm gonna drive in a big U. And I'm going to meet a jogger again on the end of this part of the road. Go to the grass, a big pothole, big dip in the road. Do not wish to drive there. Some lower branches, also not very nice. And I just told you, and there she is, the jugger. Let's give each other some room. Sportsy woman. No, I have to go this way, driving in circles, which is of course not very handy to do. Luckily I'm on my bike, and if I've done it by walking I will really be pissed off. Well, getting back where I came from. Looks like the underground is made of seashells or something. And this time I'm going to the left. I came from the part where it will go when I go straight, but now let's go here. It's a decent bike lane. Also loose concrete slabs, but the pieces are put together more nicely and more flat. A while ago driving the one in Haren. Haren to not Groningen to Haren langs the A28 new bike lane it was way more bumpy than this one by the way I have wind on the head headwind Maple leaf pot. Maple leaf, symbol of Canada. They have in their flag a maple leaf uh, or symbol of a leaf.
just waited for that car. People in front of me couldn't. It's better to wait, otherwise you will get in trouble. You do not wish to be in trouble, do you? I don't. So, make it easy, take it easy. Last time I also went here. Go here. Let me have a look where I am. No names, no street sign, no nothing. Let's have a look on that sign, because there was a sign with something on it. Not sure what. I'm gonna find out in a minute. film this for a bit. I'm actually at the red arrow. Very nice. Continuing where I was going. Let's have a look. Last time I went straight, I'm going to go to the right. Again, a whoop de doo Reversed one. Just a speed break in the road. Some issues with my fender, at least I'm hearing it, other things you want to hear. Some ducks on the road, get to the side ducks. You're walking in the bike lane, Mr. Ducky, or female ducky. The foot, ducks. Let 
not sure what this bike is squealing about. I don't like the squeal actually. Let's take a right to here. Loefzijde. Het vooronder. Als je het neemt. Jesus Christ, what a kind of noise made. Also Leeuwborg. Hopefully not a dead end. Could be, hopefully not. Vooronder en boeg. Bouw. En vooronder is de part beneath the bow, or in the vicinity of the bow. Sightseeing Leeuwborg again, part one and two. An old car, older car, not sure what kind of car. Looks like another dead end. It can be because somebody parked his car here. So you should be able to go somewhere. So I think. A little steep hill thingy. All down here from here. Well, we made it somehow. Not sure where this is going. Have a look. You're going nowhere. Gas Unie. Oh, off the road. Did get a corner quite well. Somebody put his window blinds here. It's of course way too much trouble to get it to the to the container to put it in the bin. Chopper. Take a right on the roundabout. And let's see if we can get spot a sign for the names. 
vaargeul. Licht boy to my right. It's all to, has got to do with shipping. Shipping parts of ships, terms you use on a ship. an irritating amount of noise. Pedals are not working like it should uh, be doing. Squealing along. Damn you. Why are these pedals making this kind of noise? Little bit up um, over a bridge. This bridge is crossing the wing road. So, going to get on the inside of the ring road. Don't pedal, just roll down the hill. A little bit of headwind, so that's going to slow me down. To my left, Speenkruidstraat, the Kalmoesstraat. Now you know. Just the lines going through here, almost underneath the houses. Wouldn't want to live there on the power lines. Not the most most fun you had in years, so don't live on the power lines. Not good at all. Power lines can be dangerous, they say, at least living underneath them. Also very dangerous to the touch. Don't ever, ever touch your power line. It will kill you. Camper van just fits on the on the area where you can park on that, that family's property. Camilleweg. kilometers an hour zone play yard for kids well, at least it looks like some kind of kinderboerderij a child's farm playground thingy Getting a little bit tired. But I'm still not home. <laughs> so, tired on that, I have to continue.
would look to go to the left as possible. And the bridge is open, which is very nice, of course not. Damn! Second time this day. ships. I'm not gonna wait for it. Driving around this. Hopefully I'm on time. You saw a sign, center of city of Groningen 2.4 kilometers. Well that could be uh, right. part has two bridges so when one bridge is open or closed in my way I can always get to another Phew. Ah. stop for a bit Rolling back. I want to film this container ship. That's what I'm talking about. Layers of containers. Talked to this earlier. This internal transport in containers and local waterways Continuing to driving home Had that ship on there for a little bit That's the container transport I talked earlier in another movie About the Verde Kolbrug And the constructions beneath it for cyclists to go over This was only two layers of containers, it should be four. There's two more than this and the bridge is way too low. Take a right here. 
have a green, so that shouldn't be an issue. rolling yes still rolling well somebody put his seating arrangement out look like the seating arrangements was out of fashion 20 years ago probably was not able to fit it in the underground container and then you put it outside for somebody else to take away which is the normal thing to do here well it's not normal it's just a asocial really Muldersweg. Nice to know. Pstuw. Voorrechtskade nummer 14. Big sign outside, nummer 14. Most the park is this, by the way. It's not a park, it's just cold like it. Up in the Peters Kamper single. Pretty wide. Luckily, they respond to my bike bell. It's quite handy when you pass, want to pass people. Just ring your bell, and hopefully they hear it and will go and let you pass. It's normal in Holland, by the way. Not going to shout at people or tell people get out of my way or going to the left or the right. No. You just tell people I'm coming by ringing your bell.
strange turning and no not putting out your hand. Two in a row. Balding man and now this woman. A little bit to the left of this bike lane to get out of the door zone. Somebody decides to open the door. I will have some time to react, and otherwise I will hit the door. Well, I ended up at the Corraweg, almost home. It was a nice ride, wasn't it? Well, I thought so. Good. Bit of a longer one, not sure how long, but that I will know when I lo upload my movie. Well, thank you very much for riding with me. Please like the video. Also, subscribe to my channel if you're not a subscriber yet. Also, I would like to invite you to hit the bell button and you get a notification when I upload my next movie. Of course, see the description box, links to my other videos. I make 360 movies, so also have a look at them. And I will see you next time. Have a great day and be very safe out there.